I'm think, just naturally beautiful. I think if, I was born with it. I it's not Maybelline. On this episode of the FAQs, your favorite YouTubers are answering your questions about beauty hacks. My secret to great skin is to always moisturize. I really love Kiehl's products. I use weekly masks. If you take care of your body, then your skin will look good too. And my secret to maintaining my hair is whenever I'm styling it, I'm gonna make sure that I put in some form of heat protectant. Dry shampoo is my life savior. And then a colored shampoo or conditioner. My favorite is from Overtone. Their products, it's so good. I go to the Fantasy Nail Salon and they wax my eyebrows for me. Do they do anything else? I think my cure-all product would definitely have to be argan oil. I rub it into my cuticle nail beds. Vaseline, because you can use that anywhere, anytime. Coconut oil. You can use it to cook, you could eat it for fun, and use it on your face. Fix Plus by MAC. It's a wonder product. Shampoo, uh, maybe the occasional conditioner. That's basically my extent. My favorite beauty hack is when you're doing winged eyeliner to take a little bit of concealer on a small brush and clean up right against the eyeliner. I love putting baby oil on before I step out of the shower, and it like, locks in all the moisture from the water concealer around the lips that makes your lips look so plump. You would be shocked at the difference eye cream makes and I literally layer it on before I go to bed and I wake up and it's like beautiful. I've heard using hemorrhoid cream underneath your eyes gets rid of bags. Of hickeys too. Someone put cat litter on their face once. Putting beer in your hair. People using raw eggs as shampoo. Snail eye cream, they have snail face mask. Peanut butter as shaving cream. I'm not going to waste good peanut butter. Avocado is good to put on your face. And it's, it's good also good in a burrito. Oh, I love in burrito. If it makes me beautiful, I'm trying it. Now it's time for Fax Us Anything. I'm just starting to wear makeup, but makeup is so expensive. How do I know what's worth spending money on? Do you have any low-cost favorite products? Girl, I feel you. The easiest way to find out what's worth spending money on when you're just getting into makeup is to hang out on this site right here, YouTube. See what girls have to say about some of the products you're interested in. Consult a professional, someone at Sephora or whatever makeup counter you go to, as long as they don't work for a particular brand. The drugstore does have a lot of really amazing stuff. I love Rimmel's lip liners. Elf has one of my favorite concealers. It's only $3. The Real Techniques brushes, Forever 21 nail polish. The Maybelline Fit Me Poreless Foundation. I never thought I would find a product from the drugstore that works so well. By keeping it less is more, you're not going to be spending a lot and it's easier to replace. Cheap makeup isn't always the worst and expensive makeup isn't always the best. You have to find a happy medium of what's best for you and what's best for your skin. My best tip to look good and feel good is to experiment and figure out what works for you and what helps you to feel your best you. I will do my makeup however I want to and however I'm going to feel most beautiful. For more FAQ, subscribe here. Look, what? look, this is very easy. <laughs> you know you want to. All you, you gotta do is click. To. Just click, like, subscribe. Like.